back to another in-home diagnostic video brought to you by appliancevideo.com. Okay, what we're looking at is a uh, Maytag freezer on the bottom. What's going on is it's leaking water. What I found was that uh, the drain is plugged. You can see water down in the corner. So I gotta pull all, everything out of the freezer and remove the door. What you will need for this uh, repair is a good flashlight, a turkey baster, a regular uh, screwdriver, a quarter inch nut driver, or you can also use a quarter inch for your uh, a drill or, and a pair of pliers. What we're gonna do is depress these clips so we can get the bins out of here. What you wanna do, I like to take this whole door off and the tracks is one unit so that way it's easier to put back on. So what I have to do, is depress these clips here and then pull the track out. You have to do that on both sides. Okay, I'm going to be removing these four screws so I can remove the rail. I have to do it on both sides. Next, I'll be removing the thermistor cover and also the air deflector. You just put a screwdriver in the hole and then rotate and that comes out. And then there's four more screws I gotta take off to get to the back. I'm just gonna chip away the ice and then I'll throw some hot water down the drain to get rid of the rest. Just going to shoot hot water down the, the drain just to free up the ice. Okay, so again, I'm just pushing water down the drain to clear the ice from it. All right, so now we're going to put the back panel back on. Make sure that the thermistor wire is out from the back so that way you can hook, put it back into its cover. So now I'm going to put the side rails back on. They're held in place by the four screws. So I'm going to put those back in. And repeat that on the other side as well. It is bad. I want it to happen. 
Because you know. all the shelves back in. Okay. All right, it's very important that you want to check the seal of the door to make sure that you have the tracks in there properly. And this one is. We remove the cover. Okay, all we have to do to put the duct bill on is to just push it up onto the tube and what that will do is keep moisture from getting inside the uh, refrigerator but allowing the condensation from the defrost cycle to get out. We're going to put the back panel back on and then the repair is complete. Let's go put the front panel on and just clips into place. Thank you for watching another in-home diagnostic video brought to you by appliancevideo.com.